We at Paul's Fans, if a new customer calls and they need a new fan, well, first thing I want to find out is the CFM pressure, elevation, temperature, and what's in the airstream. And once I figure all that out, and the customer gets me the information, then I select a fan. And I want to select a fan that's at the highest efficiency. That way the brake horsepower is lower, and then, you know, that saves cost on the customer. And also, after that, I will do a scale drawing and send it to the customer to ensure that it's going to fit in that location. And from there, this is what's different with Paul's fan compared to our competitors. Every blade that we build in every fan is custom. So I do shroud stresses and also shaft stresses and blade deflection. And also, we do a burn analysis. Once the fan is completely constructed, we test it. We'll balance it, line it up. Then I'll send my guys out to install it, to commission it, to ensure it's running properly. We'll wait 24 hours, and after 24 hours, we come home. I had a customer contact me, and it was, it was, it's gonna be a very custom fan. Fitting it in the location it needed to be, also being able to construct a fan that can withstand the heat, the pressure, but more importantly, maintain the same static pressure while running different CFM. We had to install damper doors and also use a VFD to maintain that pressure and to be able to operate different CFM. This, this facility was growing and it was gonna grow over time, so they needed 110,000 CFM at 18 inches, but they also needed it to be able to grow to 150,000 CFM while maintaining the 18 inches. And basically the time frame of constructing the fan and getting on site is one of the reasons we got the job. And being able to fix their problem, offer them a custom fan that was above class four construction and install it in time.